Hello. Yes, finally we're hooked up and we're going. Okay. Uh, what I'd like to do, Sherry, is ask you a few questions here, and uh, I'll play the uh, role of uh, one of the characters on the show. We do a show called Kids Radio Show. And he's called the Giant Blueberry is what it is, and the kids all know who he is. And uh, well, I'll just more or less have him be asking you questions. But before we do that, uh, I, I was wondering if you could do uh, a test reel here with a promo for that we'd like to use also on the air. We're going to run your show, incidentally, the uh, Lamb Chop in the Land of No Manners one show and uh, run the whole thing all the way through and so on and intersperse some of these interview lines with the show on commercial breaks. Okay, so uh, I was wondering if you could maybe we'll do a test here and also do a promo for us here at the same time. I was wondering if you could say, hi, this is Sherry Lewis, and then say, and this is Lamb Chop, and we'd like to wish the kids' radio show a very happy 10th anniversary. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Uh, Are we ready? Are we going? Yeah, I have heard. Okay, go ahead, Sherry. Hi, this is Sherry Lewis. Me too. Well, you're not Sherry Lewis. Uh, this is Lamb Chop, and we would like to wish the kids' radio show a very happy birthday. Tenth, right? Tenth, right. Very good. Okay. Thank you very much there, Sherry. Now, I'm going to go ahead and we'll start the question. Hi, Sherry. This is a giant blueberry. I never talked to a giant blueberry before. Oh, well, this is a first time for everything, Sherry. Listen, how did you originally meet Lamb Chop and Charlie Horse and Hush Puppy and all those others? Well, my father was a magician. He did magic. And he had a lot of friends who were um, ventriloquists. Um, They talked to puppets and didn't hide behind curtains or anything. You could see them because their lips didn't move. And he had a lot of friends who were puppeteers who talked to puppets but did hide behind curtains and things because their lips did move. And so I got to love puppets of all kinds. And um, I started playing with puppets and loving them when I was about, oh, I think 11. And uh, that's how it all started. Well, do all of you live together in just one big house? Uh Uh-huh. Uh, We certainly do. And in fact, today uh, is a day when Lamb Chop and Charlie Horse and Hush Puppy and I go to start um, taping our new television series, which is going to be on in January. Oh, you mean I'll be able to see Lamb Chop and all of you on TV soon? Regularly, every day. Mm, Well, I can't wait. I can't wait either. Well, uh, Lamb Chop, why did you want to go to the place called Land of No Manners? Oh, because, well, you, you know, because manners seemed to be so stupid. I mean, who cares? And then when I went to the land of no manners, I discovered that it was awful, horrible, disgusting when people do not, you know, have manners. And it was a funny place to be because there were dino slobs. Dino slobs? Dino slobs. That's like a dinosaur, except it's such a mess. And their names tell what they do. They were, I mean, there was one called Tantrum, and Tantrum always had a fit. He had a fit all the time. And another one is called Belcher, because he used to burp a lot. Mm. And you know what? We discovered that you can't do anything if people don't have manners. You can't play games. You can't eat, you can't sleep. It's 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 horrible. So I I really like going to the land of no manners because it was a funny place. Ooh, it sounded like it's full of really strange creatures, all right. Yeah. Uh, well, Lamb Chop, you sing so well. Uh, I I heard you sing the song. Do you believe in magic? And um, uh, uh, did you take singing lessons somewhere? Yeah, I like I like music. I take lots of music. Lessons. I play in instruments and I sing and I. I like to take lessons. It's. I like music so much. Mhm. Well, uh, where where is Hush Puppy originally from? You know, when I listen to Hush Puppy talk, it sounds like is he from way down south or? He's from Arkansas. Arkansas. Yeah. Oh, I see. And and Charlie Horse too. 
How about Charlie Horse? What's the, what's the story behind Charlie Horse? Well, Charlie Horse comes from New York City. Oh, I see. Yeah, I come from New York City. So you all come from New York City. Not Hush Puppy. No, not Hush Puppy. Of course, yeah, Arkansas. Yeah, Arkansas. Well, uh, I also wanted to ask you, uh, now, the, we were talking about the land of no manners. Now, is that going to be available to all kids on uh, cassettes and uh, yes, CDs? It's, it's, it's a video cassette, and also, also it's an audio cassette, hmm. both things. And you can even get it on CD also, is that right? No, I never had a CD. Ooh, but it sounds so good. I listened to the whole thing all the way through, and it sounded so good on CD. It is? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's good. I have, they didn't send me one yet. I didn't get no CD, any CD. Oh, well, it's wonderful. Oh, well, I'm so glad. I'm glad you liked it. It's funny. Yes, it is, especially when uh, the way you got rescued in the land of no manners. Can you tell us a little more about how uh, who came to the land of no manners to help you out? No, I, I don't. It's a secret until until everybody hears it. Oh, okay. I I believe in secrets also. Yeah, Hush Puppy rescues me though, because he's my do- my my good friend. Mm hmm. And and Charlie Horse was also in that one too, wasn't he? Yeah, but he's a stinker. Mm hmm. Uh huh. I think there were some things that went on during the story that showed that. Yeah, he's Charlie Horse is so big. He thinks he's so big. Well, that's true. And you're kind of little too, aren't you, Lamb Chop? So little. Mm hmm. So little. Does that ever bother you when you're so little? Only when he thinks he's so big. Uh huh. Because kids are all kind of little too, aren't they? Well, some are bigger than me. Mm hmm. I'm only 18 inches. 18 inches tall. That is small. Yes, it's very small. But you do such big things, Lamb Chop. Everybody enjoys the big things that Lamb Chop does. I have a big mouth. Everybody says, Lamb Chop, you have a big mouth. Well, you've got a big heart, though, Lamb Chop. That's what everybody enjoys also. Oh, that's nice. Thank you so much. What city do you live in? Well, we're in Stillwater, Oklahoma. I've been in Tulsa and Oklahoma City. Mm-hmm. What do you think of the place? I like it a lot. I like I like Oklahoma. Well, hopefully you can come back here sometime because I know all the kids would love to see you again. Excuse, excuse me, Mom. We're ready for you downstairs. Okay. Okay, well... Uh, just one last one last line here. Uh, maybe you can just uh, say uh, uh, it's nice talking to you all and goodbye to all the kids uh, listening to kids' radio show and so on. Oh, I will. Okay. Will Lamb Chop or Sherry, do you have anything else to say to the kids? Well, I like talking to you a lot, and and I like um, being on kids' radio. I hope all the kids have a really nice day, and I send a kiss. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Bye-bye, Lamb Chop. Goodbye. This is really a blueberry? Yes. Yes, goodbye, Mr. Blueberry. (laughs) Okay, thanks. Oh, it's a pleasure. Okay, I really enjoyed it, and my wife and I have always been big fans of it. even had Lamb Chop puppets when we were kids, so. Well, thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Mm-hmm.